Ellis B. Feaster's Radio Air Check and Classic TV Channel. Edward R. Murray. The Moles are the Applejacks. And this is KFWB number one in Los Angeles, where you get the news once an hour, not once a day. Good luck and good listening. Get the news, get it fast. Get the news before it's fast. Every hour of the day, you get the news while it's really news. And not bad history on KFWB. Los Angeles retail clerks and food employers to sit at table tomorrow for first time since the ninth of the month. That's the top news story of this instant. It's 4.55. This is the 5 o'clock edition of KFWB Instant News, a news feature of TSA, Pacific Southwest Airlines. Los Angeles, an end is in sight to the long, drawn-out strike lockout affecting 1,000 Southland markets. Robert Fox, representing the Employers' uh, Council, told KFWB News that they, the employers, welcome the opportunity to meet with the union. Fox went on to refer to a statement allegedly made today by union spokesman De Silva. Fox said the new union wage proposal, as reported today by Mr. De Silva, represents at least a slight departure from his uncompromising position of the past. Speaking for the union, Leonard Shane told KFWB listeners that, as always, the union was looking forward to sitting down at the bargaining table with the employer's representatives. Both sides said they would be at the appointed location tomorrow at 2 p.m. Meanwhile, the man who called the meeting, State Conciliator Whistler, says although his, uh, he's not altogether optimistic about the results of tomorrow's session, it may grow into a harmonious get-together at which some settlement in the long, drawn-out, 21-day-old dispute will be reached. Well, come on. Come on and fly with me. You might as well fly the fence. The early morning flight to San Franciscan features complimentary continental breakfast. Snacks served on all other flights. PSA, the nation's leading intrastate airline, 80 flights a week, serving both Los Angeles airports. Non-stop to San Francisco, only 1181 plus tax. San Diego, 545. For first-class care at a reasonable fare, fly PSA. Call Stanley 7, 5421, or Spring 61600. Havana, one million mass in front of Cuba's presidential palace in rank and file show of support to their new leader's government and the way the new government is meeting out punishment to fallen government soldiers accused of serious war crimes. The Nationals heard Fidel Castro say that the war crimes trials will continue and those found guilty of murder and torture will be shot. Hollywood intimates have joined casual friends today in paying solemn tribute to C.B. DeMille. The 77-year-old film magnet and uh, cinema pioneer died in his sleep this morning of a heart ailment. Cambridge, Massachusetts trackers say they've sighted death dive of America's talking Christmas moon. The Atlas satellites believe headed toward its final resting place, oblivion through fire, now that it's entering the Earth's atmosphere. Vandenberg Air Base, first polar satellite shot uh, was again postponed again today as air officials at California launching site claim technical difficulties. Uh, would cause more delay in Operation Discoverer. Los Angeles cop killer James Hooten sentenced to die in San Quentin's gas house. Los Angeles search continues for third party and holdup of Hollywood Bar, resulting in murder of film executive. Other two members of the ill-fated trio are arraigned along with their missing partner on one count of murder, two of robbery. Still being sought is ex-mental patient George Scott. Here's a special announcement. PSA now serves both Los Angeles airports to San Francisco and San Diego. Let me repeat, PSA now services both Los Angeles airports and at the same low fare, only 1181 plus tax, non-stop to San Francisco. You can pay more but can't fly better than PSA, the nation's leading interstate airline. For flights from Lockheed Air Terminal, call Stanley 7 5421. For flights from International Airport at in Inglewood, call Spring 6 1600. Fly PSA. Now the condition of the entire Los Angeles freeway system at this instant. Here's Bill Angel at KFWB Freeway Control. On the Hollywood Freeway, inbound, rolling all the way to Civic Center. Outbound, heavy, out of the Civic Center, and then congesting from Western to Coenga. Harbor, outbound, interchange to Olympic. Inbound from Olympic to the interchange is heavy. Pasadena, outbound, interchange to the tunnel area is moving slow. Santa Ana, 
outbound, 4th to Soto Street is heavy. San Bernardino outbound, Civic Center to City Terrace is slow. That's it from on the freeways now. From the KFWB weather wire, the forecast for our town, variable thin cloudiness tonight, sunny on Thursday with uh, some clouds. Continued cool tonight with low near 50 locally, but 38 in the suburbs. Little warmer tomorrow with high of 71. Today's high was 68. The current rating in our town, 65. This has been the 5 o'clock edition of KFWB Instant News, presented by PSA, Pacific Southwest Airlines. This is John Babcock reporting. KFWB Electronic News, the Pulse of Los Angeles. Next news as it happens, next scheduled news in 55 minutes. Get the KFWB News Habit and get the news.